May the blessing of God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit be upon your life and your family. May the blood of Jesus cover our life and our paths. We declare Holy Spirit, that we need your guidance. The same voice that brought Lazaro from the dead, is the voice that is here with us at this moment. Jesus, we need you Lord now. We need the Lord right now. And we pray my God, that the Lord will reverse situations, reverse difficult cases, reverse problems that are impossible for men. We believe in miracles. We believe in the supernatural of God. We believe that Jesus Christ frees, Jesus Christ heals, Jesus Christ restores, Jesus Christ prospers, Jesus Christ opens doors. Jesus Christ has the power to save our entire house. Our whole family. We declare Lord, that you are faithful, to fulfill your word. You are faithful to bring transformation to our lives. We rebuke every spirit of evil, all envy, cursed words, plagues, even everything that is in our life, to blow our way. We ask you Lord, to send help into our lives. We believe that God is reversing situations at this moment. If you need a change in your life. If you need God to reverse a situation. You need to hold on to him, with all your faith. I do my function here, which is to intercede for you. But you also need to do your job, which is to get attached to God. With all your strength. Whether you're sleepy, you're tired, you will give up anything, and you will dedicate time to God, to pray and ask for His blessings. If you need God to reverse a situation in your life, write in the comments, I cling to God. Let God act in your life. Allow me to read another testimony here for you. Hello. My name is Teresa. I have prayed, through the prayers on the Communion Life channel, for the health of my cousin, who has bowel cancer. In the last MRI, no injury appeared, he is healed. To the honor and glory of the name of the Lord. I'm from Virginia. A hug Teresa. God continue to bless your life, and those you love. God is faithful. God is wonderful. God is powerful. He restores the life of those who believe in Him. Let's pray. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. He restores my soul. He guides me in paths of righteousness for His name's sake. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. For you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil, my cup overflows. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life. And I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Lord, I pray for a supernatural intervention in the life of this person, who is praying with me at this moment. Who is closing to the Lord in this purpose. Release your grace into the life of every person here. I pray that the Lord will enter with provision, with intervention, with miracles, into this person's life. And remove all obstacles from her way that are holding her life. I declare healing over all who are sick. Be healed in the name of the Lord Jesus. I pray that you receive peace which exceeds all understanding. And may this peace remove all depression anxiety, sadness, anguish, 
and may a supernatural joy begin to fill your heart. May the presence of God fill your home, fill your life. I am right now unioning my faith, with your faith, and putting your situation before God at this moment. And I declare, God will reverse your situation. In Lord Jesus' name. Amen. Glory to God.